Hello, I am Dr. Nayan. You are watching Biodesk. In our last video, we have discussed silkworm under the unit invertebrates. Continuing this chapter, today we shall study honeybee. Honeybees are flying social insects living in large colonies. A single colony may contain 20 to 80,000 individuals. A single colony includes offspring of same mother. Honeybees are always busy and they work in coordination. They maintain good discipline and so division of labor. They feed upon pollens and nectars of flowers. Honeybees play a great role in pollination. They produce and store honey. They prepare their beehive by using the material bee wax. Let us see first the classification of honeybees. Honeybees belong to the kingdom Animalia. Subkingdom Invertebrata. In fact, they are without endoskeleton or backbone. Honeybees belong to the phylum Orthropoda. Class Insecta. Remember, insects have distinct divided body. The body divisions include head, thorax, abdomen. They have three pairs of jointed legs. So, kept in class Insecta. Common name Honeybee. Honeybees are of several varieties. One of the most common varieties include Apis mellifera. So we say the scientific name of honeybee Apis mellifera. Remember when we write scientific names the words are underlined separately. First letter of the first word is written in capital and that of second word written in small this one generic name genus and this one species so this is the scientific name of one of the variety of honeybee a study of bees is called melitology and a rearing of honeybees is called apiculture. Remember, last time we have seen sericulture, a rearing of silkworm. Apiculture is the rearing of honeybee at commercial scale for the production of honey and bee wax. Let us see the external structure of honeybee. As discussed earlier, honeybees are flying insects. The body is elongated cylindrical and segmented. It consists of three distinct divisions head, thorax and abdomen. Three 
three distinct parts in their body similar to other insects head is small hemispherical and anterior part it bears a pair of large compound eyes remember compound eyes are the union of several visual units in the head we see a pair of compound eyes three simple eyes which are called ocelli ocelli they are sensitive to light detecting the presence or absence of light ocelli termed as simple eyes also three in number the head also bears a pair of small many jointed antennae antennae are sensory structures and the mouth parts are present in the head region mouth parts are suited for chewing and sucking or lapping type the thorax is segmented it bears three pairs of jointed legs and two pairs of membranous wings these are called four wings and hind wings similarly the legs are termed as four legs mid legs hind legs the abdomen is long and segmented it consists of nine segments the abdomen is larger in queen bee while in workers the posterior end of abdomen bears a sting connected with the sting gland let us see the diagram of honey bee now as discussed earlier head thorax and abdomen are the three distinct regions in the body head is the anterior part thorax the middle one and the abdomen posterior part in head region we can show here a pair of large compound eyes and a pair of short jointed antennae mouth parts are situated downwards so cannot be shown in the diagram the thorax bears three pairs of jointed legs we can show the legs here legs are jointed with many segments these arise from th 
थोरैक्स 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 थोरैक्स
means reproductive members but male individuals so queen fertile female drones fertile male they live for about 4 to 5 weeks and their duty is, is to mate with the queen in order to fertilize the eggs so fertilization is the duty of drones and most of the individuals in a colony are workers these are the smallest of the three different castes they are numerous in number counting about 99% in a colony their number may vary from 50000 to 80000 in a colony these are sterile means non reproductive female individuals they perform all the duties of the hive except reproduction they live for about 6 weeks they serve as nurse bee soldier bee and worker bee so all the duties of the colony from cleaning feeding protecting and collecting food items from different flowers so three different types of individuals found in the colony of honeybees they are queen drones and workers remember queen is a reproductive female drones are reproductive male and workers are non reproductive or sterile female individuals thus distinct caste system for distinct duties so this was all about the structure and caste system of honeybee in the next video we shall see its life cycle and its economic importance see you in the next part thank you